So I brought a banana so I can get some potassium going. And I forgot it in my pocket. My pocket is, my pocket is wet. <laughs> Hey gang, it's Jamie from Farmerday. Still quite a bit of work to do. Saw minus 26 when I went to get my Tims this morning in the car. She cold. We're gonna get to it. Yeah. So, turns out I forgot my PPE again. This time it wasn't the bucket, which is on that tree. It was my chaps, so I gotta go back. <laughs> Ready to go. part of this entire process is taking these stumps out and that just completely decimates the chain let me tell you i've completely worn out this uh oregon chain i have to bring it into the house and sharpen grab that one there So all the chainsaw things that I've learned so far are from YouTube. <laughs> um, if 
got the channel, but I'll, when I get to editing this video, I'll, uh, I'll make sure to link it. Something saloon. That guy's awesome. Almost got there, so close. I just have that left. <laughs> I pushed hard, but if I, if, I, if I go too fast, I'm gonna end up getting hurt. We don't want that. So, man, I don't know if you, could, if you all see that, uh, that sun. <laughs> Which way is my finger going, that way? that uh, beautiful it's, it's even better in person here well we're gonna come back out here tomorrow and finish it up and then potentially clean up the trail so we'll see you again in a bit hey everybody day two learned an important lesson yesterday i uh, gotta drink some water so all i drank yesterday was coffee and I sat down last night to watch a movie with my, uh, with my kids. I came to get up and uh, my groin muscles ended up locking up on me. Probably so far the worst uh, <laughs> pain that I've experienced in a very long time. So I've learned an important lesson. Electrolytes. <laughs> Bring plenty. Drink often. So... Like I uh, said last night, didn't quite get to the end, uh, but uh, it won't be much of a push today. So I'm gonna go ahead, 
and uh, gonna move the remaining trees. Then after that, the plan's gonna be to do a bit of cleanup today and uh, maybe start scouting where I'm gonna open up an acre or two. Yep. So, I finally made it to the end, and uh, that was a lot of work. Now the real work begins, where I gotta figure out, I gotta, I gotta plan my, my homestead here, see where I'm gonna clear some fields, but at least this gives me access to the property, so I could, I could uh, branch out on that side. On this side, I'm quite close to the property line, so I left a, a solid uh, 100 foot buffer between me and the neighbor. And uh, on this side, I've got uh, almost 500 and 575 feet I can go into. The idea is I'm going to clear about an acre or maybe two. And then, uh, and then see if I can grow some, uh, some hay. If I can grow some, uh, some hay, then uh, I'll be able to feed my eventual sheep. Which will give me eventual manure which will help me acclimate my soil. So job one, road built. We're going to do a little bit more cleanup. And then uh, this summer, I'm not going to worry about the stuff on the side that I, you guys have seen uh, me uh, store. Uh, for now, I'm going to just keep it to what it is. And then eventually uh, I'll get all the brush out of the way and, uh, and those, those trees uh, cut into some firewood. Or fence post, either or. So, that's all for today. I am um, pretty tired. It's early in the day, but I think I'm going to take a break now that the mission is accomplished. So, if you like this video, uh, don't forget to subscribe and uh, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to be notified when there's more videos, make sure to click the notification bell. So, we will see everybody next weekend.
Yep. Oh, shit. Ha, ha, ha.